Once I was done at the guitar store and got a quick bite to eat, I was then off to the Ishibashi drum store. Upon arriving at Ishibashi drums, you are met with an insane amount of drum gear, drum shells, pedals, cymbals, sticks, anything percussive in nature, they have it. Now, obviously I am not a drummer, but there are, there's a lot of stuff in here and there's a lot of unique stuff. Uh, I've seen some, uh, some Vistalite stuff, some clear Ludwig stuff, old stuff, new stuff, custom stuff. This is, uh, this is Candyland for a drummer. Check out this early 70s road case from Yamaha Drums. I thought this was incredible. Ishibashi Drums also has a full service drum shop. This is where drummers can take their drums in and get them tuned up, bearing edges checked, a drum heads changed out, lugs repaired, etc., etc. There's really nothing off limits in this drum shop. Ooh, this looks old. Yeah. Oh, this is from 1962. This is as old as my dad. Now I am headed to Ishibashi wind instruments. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to play a flute because you know what? Why not? So fluff fact, I used to play trumpet before I started playing guitar. I was an accomplished trumpet. I'm just kidding, I didn't, I was very bad, but I did play trumpet. I don't know who's playing now. He's definitely better than I was. Ishibashi's woodwind and brass location carry some of the nicest and most top shelf used and new instruments. Even though I am not an expert in this field, there was some pretty nice stuff in here. She's actually gonna let me try a saxophone, I think. We'll see how it goes, I'm not really sure. This just feels so weird. Where does this, and this goes like that or like that? Sorry, I'm making you touch my spit. I apologize. You're a very strong, brave woman. <laughs> this, I don't know how to. Oh boy, uh, I don't, <laughs> oh God. Just like at the guitar and drum stores, there is a huge focus at the woodwind and brass store on variety. There are top shelf instruments in extreme quality as well as a huge focus on student and entry level instruments. I don't know what kind of tuner that is, but I want this. So a huge part of Ishibashi's uh, fluted and wind instrument business is actually repairs. They do a lot of repairs to all sorts of different instruments and I'm gonna try to get them to let me see that in action. Okay, so they're gonna actually let me film them repairing a saxophone. I'm, I'm pretty curious, let's do it. So apparently what happened with the saxophone is it was dropped or had some damage at some point and some of the valves that open and close we're not sealing properly. So right now we are watching the repairman uh, look for light. There's a light inside of the saxophone and he is looking for any light leakage, which would also indicate air leakage. To confirm the valves have been seated properly, he is then using a piece of tissue paper as a feeler gauge to make sure everything is seated around the opening for each valve. As a final step to ensure all the repairs are complete and done, he checks the tuning by running some scales. And not surprisingly, he was a really good player. 